This video is on how to apply for a journeyman license. Before you begin, ensure that you have all of the information and documentation that's needed. Let's review what's required. The following documents are required to submit a journeyman application. You must have a current photo for an ID, a state issued ID, and if you're applying for a water heater specialist license, the following documents are required. Certificates of training completion and verification of installation experience. If an associated apprentice plumber is not added, the following documents are required. Affidavit of employment experience and third party experience verification. When it comes to the photo ID, make sure you're not wearing a hat or sunglasses. The photo must capture the top of your shoulders to the top of your head and make sure it's on a plain white background. Set your camera to the lowest resolution and size. The max file size is 100 kilobytes. Use the JPEG format only. Take the picture in landscape. In other words, turn your phone sideways. Save the photo with the file name, with your last name and then your first name. An example would be dojohn.jpg. Remember, don't use any special characters within that file name. And keep in mind the file format for all of the other requested documents should be PDF. Your application will be returned if these requirements are not met. Let's sign into the licensing portal with your user account, the one that you created previously. On this screen, select Licenses at the top right. Now you can hit Apply for a License. Make sure to review the disclaimer and then check the box to accept the terms. Continue application. On this screen, you will select a record type, Plumbing Licenses, Apprentice and or Experienced Apprentice Plumber Application, and then Continue Application. Step 1. Applicant. Click the button Select from Account, then click on the record, then Continue. Employer. Click the button Add New to enter the information. Associated Apprentice Plumber. If applicable, click the button Select Account, and then click on the record and Continue. When it comes to the Employer section, on the pop-up form, enter the required information, then hit Continue. Then click Continue Application after the pop-up disappears. Step 2. Application Details. Select the appropriate license. Lawn Irrigation Installer, Pipe Fitter, Plumber, Sprinkler Fitter, or Water Heater Specialist. Then answer the remaining questions. Continuing with Step 2, the License and Employment section, click Add a New Row under each section to enter the relevant information, then Continue Application. Step 3 is all about the supporting documentation. The option that you selected in the previous step dictates the document requirements. This was also addressed in the beginning of the presentation. Click the button Add to start uploading. To upload a file, a pop-up appears, then click Add and locate the file that you want to upload. After the file is selected, click Continue. When it comes to the attachments, select the type of record that was uploaded. After the file is selected, click the Add button and the pop-up reappears. Continue the process until all of your files are uploaded. Once complete, click Save, then Continue Application. Step 4 has to do with review, so this page shows all the information that you entered. Ensure it is accurate and ensure the documents that were uploaded are the correct type. Keep in mind the application will be returned for any required updates before processing. Now check the box to agree. Continue application. Step 5 has to do with paying your fees, so let's review those fees and then check out. Take a look at what's in your cart. Is it correct? Review it, check it out, or edit it, or continue shopping. 
Finally, you will receive confirmation emails notifying you of the application status during processing. And that's it. Thanks for watching.